but he didn't act yet. And then he shares a story about how he created a partnership. And I don't even think his story is, you know, really a good example of the step-by-step -step process because there's so much more that gets built up. Like, people can leave out so many, you know, individual things that helped mold people into who they were and how they came up with that plan. And, of course, you know, you read a book and Napoleon Hill put his heart into it and you see that, like, okay, so that's how you build self-confidence, um, you know. That's how we took initiative, but there's so many other steps that lead up to that. You know, advisors, uh, consulting, books that he read and all of that and people that he studied. So, you know, if you want to know about somebody, you're really only ever going to scratch the surface unless, you know, you spend every single day with them for a certain amount of time and you ask them the right questions. But what I think the most valuable thing from this moment, this, uh, I, uh, this story that Napoleon Hill shares about creating the offer that helped him secure $25,000 back in the day, which is probably at least, you know, a couple hundred thousand dollars today. Yeah, at least a couple hundred thousand dollars. You know, he built an offer and he found credit. He didn't even get capital. He didn't get capital just to use. He got credit and he used it in an appropriate way that was going to bring him income. So he built the offer and I really like this chapter. You know, if you, I would recommend going back to read it just for this chapter alone of how to create an offer, how to create a business plan, how to negotiate a plan with somebody that's mutually beneficial for all parties. And I think that he gave more value to the other person, to the school than he actually got for himself because basically he was taking most of the risk. I mean, if he failed or whatever, he was going to owe the school money anyway. If, you know, this, if, like everything he was doing was for the benefit of the school until he was able to pay back to the school. I mean, this is, I think this is an amazing way to build an offer that somebody who can give you what, the help that you need um, can succeed while helping you as well. And that I think that is the fundamental of like deals. If you want to get with somebody who's really successful, if you want to work with somebody who's you know built a greater name for you, you have to add some value up front before you can start working with them. So considering that, initiative is the key to opportunity. You stick that key in the door, you take initiative, go through that door, and there's opportunity on the other side. You just have to take that initiative. You have to start today, plug, plug. So you have to start today, you have to take that initiative and leadership. And I love that formula. If you get a chance to read the book, um, we're wrapping up here. So there's a link in the description below where if you go to it, you can get a copy of the book for free. And you can go in and you can look up this formula in, in the lesson five on initiative and leadership, how to take action, how to beat procrastination, and how to just start getting what you need to get done today. So I think this is an amazing timing to be able to talk about my book. Um, you know, oh yeah, and he talks about real briefly, I think this is an important topic, even if he wasn't paid for something, you know, you, you would consider it. You, you want to consider adding value, even if you're not getting paid for it. So, you know, I, I don't think that this means working with for somebody who's, you know, making you do some crazy intern work for, you know, for 60 hours a week, you know, for like six months straight. And then, you know, their business isn't really going to be able to offer you that much. You know, unless the boss is spectacular, unless you see the company going places. Um, and... Unless, you know, they're going to offer you like half the company and you see value in the company and you can help take it to the next level, you know, use your judgment on this because internships, unpaid internships are incredibly value, valuable. Learning from, you know, shadowing someone incredibly successful is incredibly valuable. And the thing is, is, you know, these people are so important. These people are so busy that, you know, they can't just take on anybody that's going to, that wants to ask them for money. You know, they get, then they're going to have to hire human resources. Then they're going to have to hire people to vet this person. And then they don't know, you know, if they'll, they'll complain if they're not getting paid enough or whatever. And they're going to want to move up. You know, that's a headache. So, you know, if you want to work for someone successful, if you want to, you know, try to create something big, then come up with a plan like this. This is an opportunity. You know, pitch it to the, to the person that you want to work with. And they might say no. They might say yes. Regardless, you'll learn something from it. You didn't lose anything from it. You got your name in front of somebody who is there. And again, this is different than creating your own business and you know offering your services because your business has to survive. And this is also different from just starting out and building your brand and you know building up that brand, working for free and building up your business. So use your judgment. There's some judgment to be done here when you're considering you know how to work for someone, whether you should work for someone for free. It's a big 
concept today because so many people are working for almost basically free like you know especially in LA where where wages are incredibly challenging to you know regular wages are incredibly challenging to meet the minimum wage and the demands of the city but you know with that said all of the ideas in this book I think are still so relevant today so powerful today be sure to check out the law of success in 16 lessons free in the description below there's also a paid copy if you wish to have the physical copy and get my book on Kindle. It will get you started no matter where you want to go. You know, it, it's a quick read. It's only 153 pages. 153 pages, tons of actionable ideas. And you know, those actionable ideas you just skim through, find one that you might like, take action on it, and there you go. And you know, every every single chapter just jam-packed with examples and you know actionable how-tos to get started today, to take action, to you know help you recognize those opportunities that are right around you. So uh, be sure to check out my book, The Power of Starting Today. Thanks so much for watching this video. Wish you the best in everything that you're doing and have a wonderful day.